So today we will see the another concept in computer graphics that is the boundary fill algorithm. So in the previous we had discussed about the scan fill algorithm. Now let's see one more uh, filling algorithm that is a polygon filling algorithm is boundary fill algorithm. So in this video I am going to cover the concept like what exactly the boundary fill algorithm and what are the types of the fill, uh, boundary fill algorithm and I am going to explain the pseudocode. So for 4 connected and, and for 8 connected pseudocode and we will also see how this boundary fill algorithm will work. Okay. So now let's start. What exactly the boundary fill algorithm? A boundary fill algorithm is also called as a recursive algorithm. So we usually call it as a recursive algorithm. The algorithm starts from checking the color of XY. So means uh, in the polygon, suppose whatever the polygon is there, in that polygon, it is going to start, start checking with the pixel, any pixel, X comma Y in a 2D plane. So algorithm has to start by checking the color of one pixel. Suppose if the found color is not equal to the fill color. So whatever the found color is there, if it is not equal to the fill color, fill color means the color that is present uh, inside the polygon. If it is not equal to the fill color and the boundary color, then it is painted with the fill color. Suppose if it is not equal to the boundary and the fill color, then try to fill with the fill color. Okay, suppose the fill color is something like uh, uh, green is there. So try to fill that uh, color with a green. And function is call all the neighbors of the XY. So after that you try to call the neighbor of that uh, pixel. If a point is found to be a fill or a boundary, then the function does not call its neighbors and returns. Okay, suppose if it, if it, it is found to be a fill. So whatever the pixel that we had find in the inside the polygon if that color is equal to the fill or the boundary color then we no need to call the function you can just simply return because it is already the green color is there so then why need to change the color okay why we need to override the color so just return it in a boundary fill there is a seed point which is fixed okay and the remaining neighboring pixels are checking to match with the boundary color and the color filling is done till the boundary is reached. So the con the bound uh, the color filling is co re uh, continuously checking the neighboring points until it reaches the boundary. So that is exactly the boundary fill algorithm is. So the boundary fill algorithm is implemented by using uh, a four connected pixel or we can use the eight connected pixels also. So if you take the four connected pixels, so after painting a pixel. So let's take a four connected pixel. After painting a pixel, if a region is a four connected, okay, so any region in the polygon, if it is a four connector, then every pixel in the region may be reached by the combination of moves in four directions. So that is left, right, up, down. Suppose this is a polygon. So inside the polygon, a pixel is there. So which you are going to be uh, starting pixel when you're considering the four point okay so we need to check so this is a pixel we need to check the left okay right up and the bottom okay like south north east west like that so we need to check the boundary uh the neighboring pixels and try it if this neighboring pixel whatever it is there if it is not equal to the fill color or the boundary color then try to uh fill with the fill color so boundary color means this the color whatever the color that is present on the boundary that is a boundary color okay this is a boundary colors and what about the fill color fill color means the color that is present inside so inside the this is a fill color okay this is a fill color so now let's see the pseudocode of the four connected pixel. Then you can get a complete clarity on how we are, how we are going to draw this uh, pixel. So the white fill int x int y uh, int fill color int boundary color. So these x y are nothing but the points of the pixel in the 2D plane. So in the 2D plane the x y or the, <laughs> the polygon inside. Inside the polygon so whatever the shape is there. So inside the polygon this is a uh, int x and int y or the pixels in the x and y coordinate int fill color f color means fill color so that is the color that is present inside the polygon and boundary color the boundary color this is the color of the boundary so first try to check 
if get pixel so whatever the pixel that i had found here so whatever the pixel that i have found so that is a xy so whatever the xy is there if that xy is not equal to boundary color not equal means means the same suppose the xy is a white okay suppose if it is not equal to boundary color boundary color is the red okay yes it is not equal to the boundary color and at the same time at the same time the get pixel whatever the pixel that is there so that pixel is not equal to the fill color also suppose the fill color whatever it is there it is something like green something like green is there okay so if this suppose this white is not equal to the boundary color as well as a fill color then what i have to do then try to fill the color so how you going to do then only it, it will enter into the if condition suppose if the fill uh, whatever the pixel that you got that is equal to the boundary color and not equal to the fill color even though it is there you are not supposed to enter into the if condition so the both conditions has to be satisfied if any one condition is failed you are uh, we are not supposed to enter into the if condition okay so okay uh, now the white color whatever it is there the pixel is in white color so that is not equal to the boundary color and the fill color so then i i enter into the if condition now i put the uh, pixel whatever the xy is there into the fill color put pixel x comma y whatever this pixel is there put this x comma y with the fill color what is a fill color a fill color i said it is a green so fill with the green okay mm -hmm. now the pixel is uh, filled with the green now check with the boundaries so what are the boundaries are there to so check with the boundaries so the boundaries so here this is suppose if you there the middle point is x comma y means the boundary above x plus 1 okay so here x plus 1 means this side this is x plus 1 the right side we are incrementing the x x plus 1 comma y with the fill color and the check with the boundary color means again it is checking the condition okay next f of x comma y plus 1 so x is there y plus 1 means here x comma y plus 1 y is incrementing and x minus 1 so x minus 1 means right left side x minus 1 comma y and x here and y minus 1 so see here so this is a four connected pixel if you see here in this diagram so this is a pixel that we had selected so whatever the pixel that you have selected first fill with the fill color if it is not uh, equal to the boundary color and the fill color try to fill with the fill color by taking put x comma y so now check with the boundaries it's a four connected so the above up x minus 1 comma y x comma y plus 1 x comma y minus 1 degree x plus 1 comma y so try to fill the neighbors so after filling the neighbors it will exit from the if condition and the program is over but still our polygon is not completely because only these boundary uh, these neighbors are colored but what about the rest of these things what about the rest of things so the rest are still not color the rest are still not color then we need to go with the eight connected pixel so if you in the eight connected pixels the diagonals are also going to be colored that is a main use here so if uh, the four connected is still not color, uh, completing the uh, polygon so try to go with the eight color and color the diagonals also so this is anyhow top right left bottom so these are colored with by using the four connected so if you select the eight connected pixel the uh, corners is also going to be colored it is also going to be checked so by using the condition x minus 1 y minus 1 x minus 1 y plus 1 x plus 1 y minus y plus 1 and x plus 1 y minus 1 so generally the complex figures follows the eight connected pixels approach only so if you want to go if you are working on the complex figures then we, it is better to follow the eight connected pixels the pixels to be tested and or the or the eight neighboring pixels the pixels on the left right above below and the four diagonals we need to be checked areas filled by this methods are called as a eight connected so this is a pseudo code so here whatever the logic i had explained this up to here it is same it is a four connected it is a four connected and the rest 
after for connected it is not exiting for the if condition it is not exiting from the function okay again it is checking some uh, one more for like diagonals so these are the diagonals okay these are the diagonals so that means this complete is is a eight connected so checking the left right top bottom okay and the northwest like means the diagonals the four diagonals that is going to be checked x minus 1 y minus 1 fill color boundary color calling that function again and putting that pixel color and again calling the function and put the pixel again call the function and put the color in the pixel so like that is checking complete picture complete diagonal all the sides all the sides it is going to be checked okay so the complete polygon is going to be colored by using the pseudo code for eight connected pixel so now let's see how it is going to be work boundary fill algorithm is mostly used algorithm in computer graphics for filling a desired color inside closed polygon which is having the same boundary color for all the sides so first steps let's see the steps how it going to be work consider the boundary color and starting point in the polygon just take the boundary color and starting point of the polygon any pixel in the inside the polygon decide whether need to travel in the four directions like is a four connected graph north south north south east west okay or eight directions like north south west east northwest northeast southwest south southeast so whatever the direction you want to be go you can select that direction then choose a fill color and travel in those directions. Suppose if that fix, pixel at that point is not a fill color that, or a boundary color, then try to replace with the fill, fill color. If it is not matching with the fill color or the boundary color, try to replace with the fill color. So we have to repeat these three two steps, steps three and step four, uh, until you visit all the boundaries. So this is how this... Uh, Boundary fill algorithm is work. I hope you understand how it is going to be work. Still, if you're facing any problem, please let me know, students. Thank you.